Hi everyone. Today we're going to talk about a common concern after wisdom teeth removal, nausea. Some people experience it and it can be quite uncomfortable, but don't worry, in this video, we'll find out what causes nausea and how to deal with it. So as you guys know, wisdom teeth removal can be a painful and stressful experience, and one of the most common side effects is nausea. Nausea after wisdom teeth removal is normal for many people and can be caused by a variety of factors, including the swallowing of blood, analgesics and antibiotics on an empty stomach, and the use of dental instruments in the mouth. Although nausea can be uncomfortable, it's important to note that it doesn't have any side effects on the extraction site, so if you have it after surgery, you shouldn't be concerned. First and foremost, staying hydrated is important. Try sipping water slowly throughout the day to keep your mouth hydrated, that will help rehydrate your body and relieve nausea. Rinsing your mouth with water can also assist to clean your mouth and remove the taste of blood. Just remember to rinse carefully and not to spit hard to avoid putting any pressure on the surgical site. Another thing you can do is avoid eating for a few hours if you feel nauseous. This is because forcing anything into your stomach can lead to vomiting and worsen your symptoms. Additionally, it's best to pause any medications or painkillers for a few hours after surgery, as they can sometimes cause severe nausea. Rest is another essential component of recovery from wisdom tooth removal. Take plenty of time to relax and rest your body. Sitting on a sofa or lying down in a quiet environment can help your body recover from the surgery. Be sure to take a nap after surgery to combat any weakness that may contribute to your nausea. Last but not least, there are a few lifestyle changes you can make to help control nausea after wisdom teeth removal. For instance, if you're a gym freak, avoid exercising and doing strenuous activity for a few days after surgery, as these activities may trigger movements in your body that could aggravate your condition. Similarly, limiting travel can also help reduce nausea, especially if you're prone to motion sickness. Digital devices can also contribute to nausea, so taking a break from smartphones, laptops, and other devices can help alleviate symptoms. Sit in front of a fan or air conditioner, put a cool cloth on your face, or try to get some fresh air if you're feeling nauseous. Meditating or taking deep breaths can also help calm your mind and relieve nausea. You should also avoid conversations or excessive talking as that will help save your energy and reduce nausea. In some circumstances, nausea following wisdom teeth removal may be an indication of a more serious problem, so be sure to consult your doctor if your nausea lasts for more than a month or if you experience additional symptoms such as chest pain or blurred vision. By following these tips and taking care of your body after wisdom teeth removal, you can help alleviate your symptoms and get back to your regular life again. And that's it for today's video. We hope you found these tips helpful. If you have any other suggestions or questions, please leave them in the comments below. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.